Hey what's going on guys are you ready to win simple snippets merchandise because this is a free giveaway video Hey what's going on guys Tanmay here for simple snippets and in this video I'm going to declare five lucky winners who are going to win simple snippets merchandise for free Now if you're wondering what this giveaway is all about last month our channel crossed 50000 subscribers and that was a huge milestone for me so i declared that i'm going to give away 15 merchandise to five lucky winners which means three products to each lucky winner and i had created a contest and there were some rules and a lot of you guys have entered the contest and i had mentioned that i'm going to be declaring the winners in october in a transparent and you know legitimate way and i know it's a little delayed but the products uh, took some time to come in but now i have all the products over here uh excluding the t-shirts basically because i will be you know taking the sizes from you guys and and depending upon the winner and the t-shirt size i will be ordering those t-shirts later on but anyways everything is set up and in this video i'm going to be declaring the winners in a random and transparent and legitimate way so what do i mean by random transparent legitimate what are these words i'm throwing in so i decided that i want you guys to also see the experience of selecting random people and i was thinking how do i make it a little you know techy how do i make it a little um go with the style of our channel so i decided why not create a program which selects random number so it's like a lottery system and whatever number corresponding to that lucky person so every every person who's entered the contest has a number and whatever number comes in he or she is going to win that particular merchandise so i've created a website and that's how we are going to declare the winner on video so that even you guys can see it is completely random process completely transparent there is nothing like i'm biased to something i'm not going to select my friends in fact i don't think any of my friends have actually participated maybe one or two but yeah this is going to be a transparent video and that's the reason why i'm making this video but enough of me talking i know i'm talking and talking but let's jump to the actual computer screen and see the entire website which i have developed from scratch i'll quickly explain to you and then we will declare the five lucky winners in this video make sure you watch this video till the end okay so coming to our computer screen as you can see i have opened up the form and in the responses you can see 90 people have responded and entered this contest 90 is kind of less but you know what it increases your chances if you entered and uh, let me just show you the results that is the form that everybody has filled okay so coming to the excel sheet of that google form what i've done is i've erased all the other details which are personal to you i don't want to disclose all these personal details in this video but i have just kept the name and the city and if you see all these entries are marked in green except these two so out of the 90 people who have entered all these people who are marked in green have actually done all the activities properly so if you go on the form there were four rules or four mandatory tasks that you had to do and out of the 90 people only 43 have done it properly so coming down these are the names that actually i have marked in red because all of these guys have just filled out the form without doing those activities especially the one where i had asked you guys to comment on my instagram pic and tag your friends this last guy has actually done it but he's from nepal so this is a this is not a international giveaway so this is that pic on instagram where i had asked you guys to comment and tag three of your friends so a lot of you guys have not done it and that's the reason why you guys are not going to get an entry into this giveaway i had told you guys that i'm going to verify all the tasks that you've done and the people who are marked in yellow they've actually done the task but they've given some wrong details like some typing mistakes in the instagram id so you can get away with that but at least you've done all the task anyways the good thing is the good news is this increases the chance for all of you guys who have done all the task so from 90 now we are down to 43 and you can see the numbers over here let me just zoom in a little bit okay so these 43 people are the ones who are going to get an entry actually it's 42 starting from 2 to 43 okay i'm going to share this sheet in the video description if you want to check it out if you want to cross check your name and i've thoroughly checked it out the red ones have not really done all the activities so yeah you guys are going to miss it out i hope next time you follow all the rules because i'm going to do a lot of giveaways in future so don't get disheartened maybe you missed it out by mistake so yeah okay so how do i go about picking out random names from these 43 entries okay so as i mentioned i had 
put a community tab wherein I disclosed that I have made a website. So let me just show that website. So this is that website that I have developed from scratch. On the top we have this huge banner of simple snippets then we have a heading. I've used bootstrap and if you watch my bootstrap series or playlist you guys will easily understand the code. I'll show that code in a minute. Over here there are five cards with 000 as number. When I click on draw a random number will be picked and that number range will range from 2 to 43. So we're gonna give the minimum as 2 and maximum as 43 and that's gonna be the range. And in that range, a random number will be picked up and shown on our website. Okay. If there are repetitive numbers, then we'll click on draw again. So I did this functionality by using JavaScript and I thought, how do I make it nerdy and you know, legitimate as well as transparent so that you guys can see that it is not rigged or something. It's completely legitimate. So now let's see the website. So this is the code behind the website. This is the basic head. And then we have a little bit of styling that I've done. Don't worry guys, I'm going to be sharing all this code on our official website. This is a one page website. This is the entire body. Then we have the division and then we have these individual cards. Okay. So this merge giveaway lucky draw contest, if you see, it's the heading over here. Then inside that we have individual cards. So this is card number one. Then we have card number two. We have card number three, card number four and card number five. Okay. Now inside one single card, we have this image, then we have a heading, then we have a text and then we have a button. Okay. And this styling is coming from this custom styling that I've done over here. Now you can go ahead and check out the link in the video description to get this entire code and you can understand it very easily. It's all bootstrap styling and coming down, if you see on the button, so each card has a button, right? So this is that fifth card you can see we are looking at the fifth card. This is the fifth text over here. So every button has a on click event. So this is jQuery. Now, if you don't know JavaScript and jQuery, you can watch my JavaScript tutorials on Telusco learnings, which was a collab video for Telusco learnings channel. So that complete playlist is on that channel. So on click, we are calling this function fn and passing a number. So this five corresponds to the card number. Okay. So this is the fifth lucky winner. So I pass five. Similarly, if you see, if you open up the fourth card, we are passing four. Okay. So this is a parameter which is passed in this function named fn and it is happening on click of this button. So every button has its ID. We don't really need the ID over here, but I've just given it for reference. Anyways, on click, let's see what this fn function is in JavaScript. So coming down, this is where the script tag is and these are some JavaScript jQuery libraries. And below that we have our custom script JavaScript. Now this is that random function that gives us a random integer between a particular range. Okay. I'll explain to you in a minute, but let's see first that function fn. So whenever a button is clicked, if I click on this one is going to be passed in that fn. So one will come over here. We are going to get a random integer between the range of one to 75. This is just for representation purpose. I'll show you how it works. Now in this function, we are checking what number is coming in the FN. Now, depending upon which button you click, if you click on first one will be passed. If you click on this two will be passed. So we are using if else to determine which number is being passed. If it is one, then we are selecting the get element by ID of this element with an ID of winner text one. So what is winner text one? So if you scroll up to this first card and if you see the H1 tag, it has the ID of winner text one. So if I right click on it and if I inspect element over here also, you can see this is the header tag H1, which has an ID of winner text one. Similarly, this heading tag, which is of comprising of four zeros has an ID of winner text two. So depending upon which button we are selecting, we are accessing that heading tag inside that card and we are setting the value in the JavaScript. We are setting the value in the JavaScript to this X value, which is the random value. Okay. And we are also changing the image. So we are changing this image to a cup image. So what is this cup image? I have this image over here. Let me just show it to you. This is that image. I'll share this entire images and entire files in the video description as I mentioned. And it's fairly easy to understand. You guys can get the hang of it. Now let's see how it works. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll give a range of 2 to 43. 
okay but just for demonstration purpose for the first time let's do a trial and let's use the range of 45 to 91 because this is for demonstration right so let me just do that we are giving a range of 45 to 91 now a random number will be selected in this range so how does this get random in function work so you pass 45 as the minimum you pass 91 as the maximum so first what we do is we do math.seal and math.floor now this is only needed when you are passing decimal numbers so numbers which are not whole numbers numbers which are having a decimal point otherwise we don't really need it so to give you a representation here are those math.random function definition so what this does is it gives us a random number between the range of 0 to 1 so if I run this you can see the code let me just zoom in you can see console.log math.random I'm getting a decimal point number because I'll get a random number in the range of 0 to 1. So we're gonna get a point number but we want a whole number in the range of this minimum and maximum value that we pass right. So right now if I click on run you can see I'm getting a random number which is 0 0.98. There is one more line which is math.seal you can see 1.4 is rounded off to 2 but if I use math.floor 1.4 will be rounded off to 1 okay. So again you can check out these functions and just by this representation I'm assuming you guys understand what is floor and seal doing. We are actually not gonna need it I'm just using it for demonstration purpose. Anyways this is the real statement that is actually doing all the work which is return because this function returns some value and it will be returned in this x variable right. So what it is doing is math.floor of math.random into max minus min plus 1 and plus min okay what what did just happen right. So let's assume our minimum is 5 and maximum is 10. So math.seal of minimum is gonna be 5 only and math.floor of maximum is gonna be of 10 only because when you pass a whole number this seal and floor doesn't really affect the change and then we are gonna pass this 5 and 10 over here right. So max is gonna be 10 right so 10 minus 5 is gonna be 5 5 plus 1 is gonna be 6. So the result of this bracket is 6 6 into now math.random is gonna give us a number which is gonna be ranging from 0 to 1. So let's assume that this is 0 0.5 okay. So 0 0.5 into what was this total 6 right. So 6 into 0 0.5 is gonna give us 3. So we got 3 now. Now again we are gonna take a floor of this number 3. Now since 3 is a whole number we don't really have any change in the floor. So after this, after this we are adding the minimum value also. So 3 is the result of this plus what is the minimum 5. So 5 plus 3 is gonna be 8. So there you go you can see we got 8 as the random integer which is gonna be returned from this statement and is going to be stored over here provided that the minimum is 5 and 10. So in the range of 5 and 10 we got a random number as 8. So let's again keep the same range 5 and 10 and let's say this time the math.random gave us 0 0.1 okay. So again 10 minus 5 is 5, 5 plus 1 is 6. So 6 into 0 0.1 is going to be 0 0.6 right and when we do a floor we will get the floor value as 0 right because floor value of 0 0.6 is gonna be 0 but now we have to add this minimum also and minimum is 5 so 0 plus 5 is 5 so you can see in the range of 5 and 10 including the lower limit 5 and upper limit 10 we got the value of 5 as the random number so depending upon what this math.random keeps on changing now this is an inbuilt function by javascript and most programming languages have a in inbuilt randomized function which, get, which gets some random number so we don't really control that. So depending upon this and using this entire expression we are getting a random value between the range of minimum and maximum. Okay. So as I mentioned let's get a number between 45 and 91 I have passed it. So this function will be called we will get a return value of some number which is going to be in between 45 and 91 it will be stored in x and depending upon which button we click on the website the text will change. So let's click this one for demonstration purpose this is not us declaring the winners. When I click on this there you go 85 number. So 85 lies between 45 and 91 and if it was a legitimate user 85 would have been Bilal Ashraf from Delhi. But unfortunately Bilal you have not really completed the, all the activities so you are not gonna win this. But yeah this was just for demonstration purpose. 
I hope you've understood. And now let's go ahead and declare the actual winners. So coming to the code, the range now we have to give is the range of the legitimate user starting from two to 43. Okay. So we're going to give two over here. We're going to give 43 over here. Coming to our website, everything is refreshed. Now let's draw the very first user. Okay. The first winner, you can see the image also changes. The first winner is number 19. Let's see who's winning number 19. Okay. So 19 is Saurav Singh from Bangalore. So that's lucky winner number one. Let me just copy this and paste it in a separate text box. Or you know what, I'll just completely change the color over here. I'm going to change the color to a purple color. Okay. So that's winner number one. Let's see who's winner number two. Okay. So winner number two is 37 coming to the file. Who's 37? 37 is Shashikant again from Bangalore. Wow. Bangalore people are winning. Let's mark this and let's give him a color again. Let me just copy this also. Okay. So three more left. If Saurav and Shashikant, you guys are watching, I will be contacting you soon. So moving on to the third winner, 38. Who's next to Sashikant? Okay. It's Narpat Kumar from Mysore. Congratulations, Narpath. I'm going to be contacting you soon too. Okay. So that's the third winner coming to our website. Two more to go guys. Two more to go. All the best to you all who are participated over here. I'll click on the draw. Okay. So it's number four. Who's number four. It's Kritika Malvia from Mumbai. Okay. So that's my hometown. Congratulations, Kritika. You are the fourth winner. So last one to go guys. Let me just draw it out. It's lucky winner number 18. Okay. So 18 is Kimaya Gaikwad. Oh my God. I know Kimaya. She's a friend of mine. That's amazing. I'm going to mark you purple. And yes, you are the last winner. How lucky are you, man? Okay. So these are the lucky winners. Let me just name them. So yeah, Saurav Singh, Shashikant P, Narpat Kumar, Kritika Malviya and Kimaya Gaikwad. You are the five lucky winners of this 50k merge giveaway. Congratulations to all of you and, and to all those who did not really win this. Don't worry guys. I'm going to do a lot more giveaways like this in future. So all the best for that. And I hope you guys win. I keep doing these giveaways from time to time in a random way as well. So you might win something in that. But yeah, that's it for this video, guys. These are the five lucky winners. And we did this in a very transparent and a legitimate way. One last thing to add is I'm going to be contacting all of you guys via email or via Instagram handle that you've provided. And you have to respond to me in five business days or five working days. And if in case you fail to respond, I'm going to select out someone else. So please be active online. If you watch this video, go check your Instagram or go check your email. I might have already mailed you. And yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for 50,000 subscribers. Once again, you've been a great support. We've already crossed like 53 and we're hitting like 54,000 subscribers right now. So our channel is growing quite well. So thanks for watching. See you guys in the next one. Peace.